Thanks, Gaz. Uh, Cripper, one of the great wins, and from what you say, the first win you've had against the Lions here at the Gabba. Yeah, it is, mate. It's, um, yeah, they, they're a tough side. They play it well up here, and it's, um, it's always interesting conditions up the Gabba. Um, yeah, the humidity, um, you know, the cricket pitch is all different elements, but I, I'm just so proud of the boys. I took a lot of maturity to be able to, I suppose, um, change momentum in the game. Um, you know, they were all over us early, but the ability to change momentum, you know, to stick to the process and, um, you know, find a way in the second half to, to really cover the ground well. And, um, yeah, like some of those big boys were awesome. It was, um, I know you guys just chatted to him then, but so happy for him. He's put so much work in. You know, went, went and um, changed up his technique a little bit and, um, you know, kicked the massive goal in a big moment, which is, uh, you know, what we love, love to see from him. Well, tell us about that. I mean, because there's always a lot of scrutiny on the high-profile players. There's a lot of scrutiny on Harry. You must be so pleased with the likes of Harry and um, Zach Williams making a comeback for them to get this experience tonight. Yeah, like, I'm just like, so, yeah, Zachy, like, he's had a tough 18 months and he just, he's so happy when he's playing footy. It's great to see and it's just good to see him smile and, um, tonight, but also the, the moment throughout the week. And then this big fella, like, um, in footy, like, you, you have your lessons and, um, you know, as a team, losing can really give you a lesson. And, um, you know, he learned a few lessons last year that he needed to uh, address a few things and he went to, went away and takes humility to really do that. And he got to work and you saw tonight, I think, I don't know, he kicked three or four, but... Yeah, he looks so confident there. And, and he's been confident all pre-season and I know there's a lot of commentary around it, but... You know, when there's commentary, you've got to give him his flowers too, and uh, he deserves them tonight. Well, halfway through that second quarter, there was a fair bit of commentary about the team. You were seven goals down. What was the atmosphere at half time? Because you'd imagine, you know, old school coach goes off his head. How was Vossi? No, he was really calm. Um, we, we felt like the last 10 minutes of the second, we started playing the way we wanted, and um, we sort of lifted around the ball. So we came in with a really high energy, and um, there was a lot of calm, but also a bit of method. How are we going to expose them? And um, yeah, then we just backed our run, but yeah. Bossy led it really well. Um, the players executed what they, the coaches wanted. And, um, you know, we play our best when we're playing hard footy and, and playing with high energy, and that's what we're, we're able to do. So, yeah, good win, mate. So, was that the thing? You come out at half time, you have two focus points. What were the main two? Yeah, well, as it's sort of like, um, we, we always build our game up for our contest and our pressure. Um, but we felt like in the first half, we're probably going really quick um, to them. And, um, you know, they were probably chipping around us and really slingshotting the way back. So, we just had to be a bit more methodical with them. Uh, make them defend a bit more and um, yeah, we're able to get it into our, our bigs one on one, set the ground up, and then we were able to put pressure on our forward half. So, um, you know, there was an even contribution um, across the whole ground, but uh, I thought someone um, that really stood up was Jackie Carroll. Um, so he's, I don't know how he's pre under 10 games, but he's had a massive pre season in terms of his body and also his mindset. And uh, he was so confident out there tonight. And, Sometimes you just need that game where you, you feel like you belong, and I reckon he, he's got that now. Absolutely. In the third quarter, he's the highest-ranked player on the ground, so he certainly staked the claim for a spot for the rest of the year. Congratulations on your performance, and, and one of the great wins. What a way to start um, the season with an opening round win up here in front of a full house. Congratulations. Uh, thanks, Lynch. Appreciate it, mate.